What's up guys? I got your recap for Thursday, February 14th here for you. It was uh, just a dramatically slow day out there today. It was pretty bleak for a while. We went through most of the, of the show thinking there was just nothing out there and we were going to have to make some desperate choices, but luckily at the very end of round two we came across this crazy freak and Nathan OT winner right here uh, from Big G stream of Nordic Gaming's Asgard Cup. That is actually pretty legit and, and very nice, and we will get to that in a second. But before we do, I just want to play the other clip I really liked for you today. This is uh, Doug gets bumped into a game winner right here. Uh, just a, a, a beautifully ridiculous play right here. So here's this for you. That's off. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Uh, oh. Just go to oh, OT. No uh, way. No uh, way. Uh, yes! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> what on earth? What? What was that? He bumped me into it. It was oh my that God. hit the ground. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, just a, a truly ridiculous play right there, but also quite amazing. All I have to say is I hope that like the other team, I hope like their friends and family are checking in on them, making sure they're okay, because. That shit will ruin your day right there. That is not something you want to have happen in your life. But uh, anyways, that was that. Then here's this, our winner from today, Crazy Freaking Nathan with this OT winner. Notice, you know, game five here in uh, the Asgard Cup. Take a look at this one here. It's a bit nice seeing Rocket League again. It is, man, it really is. Here we go, Potato now, puts it high. But uh, straight to Crazy Freak. Whoever concedes here will lose this match. Crazy Freak hits a banger and gives Reborn Titans. Finally, Reborn Titans get themselves a nice cozy win here tonight. Now, that's what we wanted to see from Reborn Titans after being reverse sweeped last week. Nice play there by Reborn Titans. Certainly not the best pass play I've ever seen, but you know, really clutch and, and nice and beautiful. Really well executed give and go. Placement on the shots, very nice. And. and you know, again, we come back to the clutchness. Game five overtime in what was probably the biggest tournament that was on today, or last night, or whatever the hell it was. So, congratulations to Crazy Freak and Nathan. You guys are our winners for today. Turning now to news, there's really only one big story from today, and that is that the, the ex-secret roster of Freaky and Flame, with the addition of Niels Cook, who's been playing in, in DreamHack with them, who was in the qualifiers with them and will be playing with them this weekend, uh, has been picked up by Velachi Esports. I'm gonna guess that's how you say that. Maybe it's Velos, but I'm gonna go with Velachi Esports. So they have been picked up, so that's good for them. And, uh, you know, best of luck to them in Leipzig. Otherwise, not a whole lot to fill you in on today. It was a fairly straightforward day. Turning now to the schedule for tomorrow, Friday the 15th. The headline, of course, is DreamHack Leipzig, which will be starting bright and early at 5 a.m. EST, which is 11 a.m. Uh, CET. So, uh, <laughs> enjoy getting up for that one, or just tuning in a little bit later. But of course, that is the $100,000 land that literally every Rocket League team in the world is going to be participating in, and should be ridiculously awesome. Then, uh, there's also a Player One Esports $500 2v2 at 7pm EST. That's the other, uh, maybe top line of that right there. But, let's not overlook the return of Boost Legacy. That's right, they're back! with a $100 3v3 at 6.30 p.m. EST. That's gonna be a bi-weekly thing from now on, so uh, look forward to that in two weeks again. But good to see Boost Legacy back on the schedule. I have missed them, so hopefully that all runs beautifully. Then Indie Gaming League has their Friday friendlies at seven, and Elevate League has tier two league play at seven, and that's gonna round out what you can expect for tomorrow. So, hope it's a good one for you. Hope uh, DreamHack goes beautifully. I'm sure it will. Really excited to see what kind of clips we get out of that. Should be, you know, a really exciting weekend here. So, uh, have a good one. I'll talk to you later. Until next time, adios.